Hey guys, it's Honey Dip. Um, I have Imaya here. Um, I just got back in. Um, I went to my Walmart near my house. I was trying to find um, this particular outfit for uh, my Imaya to wear. Um, but for some reason, the Walmart that is maybe 15 to 20 minutes away from my house had the outfit. But I was too lazy. I got off work late and I decided to go to the one that was like maybe five minutes from my house. They didn't have anything. Um, and I was wondering was it because of the weather? Um, the, the roof was leaking so they moved a lot of their clothing out of the way. They had buckets, yellow rope tied off in the baby section. So I'm looking around to see if they had the Gerber outfits with the hats to match. They didn't have it. And I was too lazy to go to the other store that was 20 minutes out. So instead, I got Amaya some um, headbands. Uh, got those two. I got some clip bows for her hair. I got her her own Hello Kitty pacifiers. I had got those for di Diamond and I cut the nipple off so now I can use them for her. So she has her own set. Um, I couldn't pass up the panda outfit. I saw pandas and I was like I gotta have it. And it had the little cute panda on the butt and it's a girl. So she's going to wear that one day. Whoops. I got it on top of you, baby. Sorry. And then tonight, she's going to wear this. I couldn't tell. Well, you know, yellow is like a unisex color, right? And I, I didn't see that at a, the other Walmart. So I'm taking that each Walmart gets different things. But it's by Carter's. It's uh, Mommy Loves Me. And I couldn't really tell if this would be for a boy or a girl. So what we're going to do is dress it up. And that was one reason why I picked up the bows for the hair. So we're going to make Maya look cute. So as soon as I change her clothes, I'll let you see how she looks. Okay, so I've changed Maya. She's in her little yellow outfit that says mommy loves me and uh, I put a yellow bow on her head because um, I didn't know if it looked boyish or if a boy and a girl could wear it but yellow looks good on her and I just decided to uh, get that for her and put it on her so that's it I just wanted to show you guys what she was wearing tonight and it's not really a sleeping outfit, but I didn't feel like putting her in no real pajamas. I just wanted her to look like a little cute giraffe today. So, yeah. So, I just wanted to uh, show you guys what she had on. And uh, you guys let me know what you think of her little outfit. And I'll talk to you guys later. Okay, last little clip. I just uh, switched out her pacifier. It's a ma'am. And I just wanted you guys to see how cute those pacifiers look in her mouth. She just looks like I'm just sitting here enjoying this. This I'm taking it all in. Mommy just got me looking so extra cute. And then the colors look great on her. It's, you know, it's so gloomy outside. I, I, I can't wait to come home from work just to hold her. I mean, I love all my other babies, but this is definitely um, my sweetheart right here. And uh, I'm going to showcase her a lot for a while and probably for a long time because I've never had a silicone before. And I can most definitely say it is something different. And you definitely have to be uh, careful with them because they are very delicate but um i love her to pieces and um my kids are they're like you treat her like she's a real baby and i'm like well 
I know the difference between a real baby and a baby, but I know that silicones, they, they just feel so close to realness that um, I'm enjoying this time right now. And I'm sure if anyone who ever had a baby, it doesn't matter if it's a silicone or a vinyl, you know exactly the feeling that I'm talking about. And you you want to give that baby all the love and all the all the attention um because excuse me. All of the attention because uh you can. So um yeah. <coughs> excuse me. <coughs> so I'm just enjoying this right now. And I just think she looks so cute and uh I'm going to end this video because I can keep going and going about her. And I know that um, she's eventually is going to be leaving me to go get painted once I get in contact with her artist. But as of right now, I'm I am enjoying how she is for who she is. I it, Her painting doesn't really bother me. Um, but I know eventually I'm going to have to get it done. But uh, I, she looks cute regardless. So that's it. That's all I have to say. Um, if you have any comments or whatever, you can always uh, let me know. And I'll talk to you guys later. Have a good evening.